At Old South Wood Preserving in Summertown, Tennessee, we provide quality pressure treated wood products for the ag fence and the post frame building industry. Our tried and true process of preserving wood utilizing the latest technology in the industry ensures that our products stand the test of time. Our team works tirelessly together to make sure that our customers are treated with the best service and care each day. I'm Eric Stoll, and as the owner of Old South Wood Preserving, my goal isn't to be the biggest supplier in the industry, but rather to be the very best at what we do. Build your project with Old South Wood. Learn more at OldSouthWood.com or call us at 931-762-9663. Efficiency, reliability, accuracy. Move forward with your real estate sale or purchase with title and escrow of Lawrence County, the most experienced closing team around. Working with clients locally and throughout the state, we offer a wide range of services, including the expertise of an on-staff attorney, backed by our more than 49 years experience in titles and closings. We get the job done on time at a fair price and ensure every last detail is correct. Our goal is to give you peace of mind when you work with us, you work with people who live where you do. We understand the importance of the real estate community and strive to build strong relationships with all parties involved in the process. Whether you're buying a home, selling a business, acquiring land, or anything in between, you're in good hands with title and escrow of Lawrence County. Put the most experienced closing team on your side. Contact title and escrow of Lawrence County today. Arts, crafts, stationery, journals, books, educational toys, wrapping paper, devotionals, greeting cards, and much more can all be found at Paper and Thread in downtown Lawrenceburg. Shop local to find the perfect gift or have a custom gift basket made for just the right occasion. Paper and Thread has a party room now available for birthdays, classes, and so much more. We could go on and on about all the neat things you'll find at Paper and Thread, but you just need to hop in your car and head down there. 106 North Military Avenue in Lawrenceburg is where you'll find them and discover what makes Paper and Thread awesome. That's Paper and Thread in downtown Lawrenceburg, 106 North Military Avenue, just north of the square. For the best at home care in Lawrence County, the Summit at Home is the right company for you. We have a friendly staff over 25 that is trained, educated, and qualified to help with all your needs within your household. Our non-medical services include transportation, housework, dressing, and companionship. We are also covered by most long-term care providers. For more information, please call 931-762-2310. Hey, this is Phil Hooper. Get the look you want for your favorite school, church, or business with apparel from HD Ink Screen Printing in Leoma, Tennessee. Got a logo you need embroidered or screen printed? Let HD Ink give you the professional look that sets the bar in today's world. We do fundraisers and custom designed apparel and so much more. Call today, 931-201-2961 or come see us at our new shop located at 26 Ingram Road in Leoma. Remember, HD Ink for the look you want and the look you deserve. This is the X Sports Network. All righty, welcome everybody back to Summertown High School. As we are here back in the losers bracket, is this game will feature the Lady Panthers of Lewis County taking on the Lady Eagles of Summertown. Hayden Burks on the call once again, joined alongside producer extraordinaire Kevin Wright. As the winner of this game, we'll take on Kolioka right after this. As South Lawrence just defeated Kolioka in a close one.
So on your screen, Summertown will be on the far side in their blue uniforms once again. Lewis County will be on the near side with their white uniforms. So far, Summertown lost to South Lawrence earlier today. They defeated New Prospect to get to this point. Lewis County was defeated by Kolioka earlier. And Lewis County also defeated Leoma in their first loser's bracket game to make it to this point. So, once again, the winner of this will play the Lady Warriors of Kolioka in the next game right after this. And then whoever wins that game will face South Lawrence in the championship game. Then again, South Lawrence has not lost yet in this tournament so far. So, in order from anybody in the loser's bracket to come home with the tournament championship, they would have to beat the Lady Stallions twice. Starting things off for Summertown will be Rupert, and the action is back underway, and I'll be down for the service ace. Here's the serve once again. It's up in the air. There's Inman. As they'll go over Rice, Pettis underneath it. Putman will set it up. Here's Cornelius, and point will go to Lewis County, as in the net was Putman. Here's the serve, as it's up in the air. Putman will set it up as they look to get it over, and it goes long. Goes to Lewis County, scores 2-1. to one. Here's the serve. As it's up in the air, Putman will set it up. Cornelius going for the kill. That's down for the kill. Ties up at two. Here's the serve by Rigsby. It's up in the air. And that's another ace as they try to save it. And back over actually, and point will go to Lewis County. That was Kelsey who just punched it over. And Lady Panthers lead three to two. Here's the serve. And as Ruben underneath, Putman will set it up. Here's Atkins going for the kill. That's down for the kill. Ties it up once again. Cornelius back to serve. Emmon underneath it. Rice underneath that one. And as Emmon will send it back over. Cornelius, Pettis now. Putman will have to get over, able to do so. He's still up in the air as they will set it up. Here's Kelsey. It's underneath it is Rupert. Point will go to Lewis County. As in the net was Pettis. Here's the surf as they get it over. Cornelius, and that'll be an ace. And that one goes back to Lewis County as they take a two-point lead. Rice once again. And back it back to back. Scores six to three. Here's the serve once again. Short into the net. Goes back to Summertown. And cuts the lead down to two. Going back to serve will be Atkins.
Waiting on Emmons to, there we go. Time to shoot up real quick. So here's the serve. They get it over. And that'll be an ace for Atkins. Here's the serve once again as they get it over. Emmon underneath it. There's Kelsey. As Raul will look to get it over. Not able to. And ties it up at six now. Here's the serve. Emmon underneath it. As Raul underneath that one. Riley will look to get it over. Still up in the air. Putman will set it up. Pettis going for the kill, and that's down for the pale point. We'll go to Summertown. There's the serve once again. It's up in the air. And as they look to set it up, Kelsey will get it over. Up in the air, Putman will set it up. Here's Pettis, looks to float it over the defense, still up in the air over for Lewis County. Riley will send it back. Robert to Putman. Pettis looks to float over, once again blocked, back over to Summertown. As they look to get it over, will do so, Rubert. There's Ralph. Ammon will get it over, high up in the air. Rigsby tries to save it, Putman looking to get it over and do so. As point will go to Ed Summertown. About to say an Etheridge there. It's in the net, I believe, was Raul. It's the serve here from Atkins. As they'll look to get it over. Still up in the air. Putman now making the save. And Rupert will send it over. As they set it up. Here's Kelsey going for it. Block. And that point will go to Lewis County as Pettis. She was able to block it, but it came down. And it's a one-point Lady Eagles lead. Here's the serve once again. As it's up in the air. And it's Phoenix. They will look to get over. Rupert tips it back up. Putman underneath the throw. Pettis looks to send it back. Emmon and point will go to Summertown. I believe that was rallying in at this time. Here's the serve. Kelsey up in the air. Emmon will look to get it over as Atkins underneath it. Phoenix looks to get it over. Raul, here's Riley now. Emmon will get it over for Lewis County. As they send it back over, Summertown. Raul, Emmon right back over to the Lady Eagles. Putman sets it up. Here's Pettis down, back over, hung on the net for Summertown. Putman underneath it though, up in the air. And that point will go to Lewis County. Scores nine to eight. Here's the serve. They get it over and that'll be a service ace. And it's now nine to nine. The scoreboard is wrong currently. Here's the serve. Just over the net. And that point will go to Lewis County, and they're on a run. And they take a one-point lead. There we go. Now we got fixed. Here's the serve by Riley. That one's long, and it ties it back up. Here's the serve by Pettis. It's up in the air. Raul. Does it look to get over? And won't be able to. That goes to Summertown, and they take the lead. So.
Serve by Pettis. As it's up in the air. Emmon underneath it. And they will look to get it over. Here's Cornelius up in the air. And point will go to Summertown. Here's the serve by Pettis. That's just long. And it'll go back to Lewis County. Rowell to serve. And she will get it over the net. Just over the net. And I'll be down for the ace. Ties it up at 12. Here's the serve once again as it's up in the air. And that point will go to Lewis County again. After the air by Summertail. Here's the serve once again. Pettis. That's Putman underneath it now. As they look to get over Rigsby, that is. Richardson has Rice now over to Emmon. Atkins tries to save it. Point will go to Lewis County again. It's a two-point Lady Panthers lead. So here's the serve. Pettis underneath it. Putman sets it up. Here's Rixby. And that will be long. Point will go to Lewis County. And we're going to have a timeout by the Lady Eagles as they trail by three. As we'll be back here shortly on the Exports Network. Truitt's Garage Doors in Leoma, Tennessee is your one stop for new garage door installations for all commercial and residential buildings. Plus, they offer full service on all existing doors. Need a new garage door opener? Truitt's Garage Doors has you covered. As an Amar Gold and LiftMaster dealer, Truitt's Garage Doors offers the best pricing anywhere in the area. A family-owned and operated business, Truitt's Garage Doors has been helping Tennessee and Alabama residents since 1999. Call the pros today at Truitt's Garage Doors, 931-201-6464. This is the Exports Network. And back here on the Exports Network, uh, Summertown is taking their first time out of this first set as they trail Lewis County 15 to 12. So here's the serve, and that one will be for Summertown. As Raul passed the line there. And here's the start by Rupert. He's up in the air. Emmons, they look to get it over. Pettis underneath it. Putman will set it up. As Atkins will just float it over. Rice back over to Summertown. Still up in the air. Pumping underneath it. Cornelius goes long. Emman. They look to get over short of the net. Point will go to Summertown. Here's the serve. Richardson underneath it. Kelsey. And as they get it over the net, Pettis will set it up. Putman now. Here's Atkins. Rowell underneath. They set it up. Looking to get it over is Kelsey. There's Rupert. Pubman now once again. Over to Atkins. She just floats it over. Emman. Rice back to Emman. Pettis. Pubman underneath it. As they look to get it over, Richardson. They set it up. Emman now. Rupert. Trying to save it. That one goes to Lewis County. Him in to serve. Short net point will go to 
He laid the Eagles again. Here's the serve by Rigsby. Rowell underneath it. As they set it up, that was Potts, and point will go to Summertown as it was called a double. Served by Rigsby. Up in the air, back to Summertown as they set it up. Cornelius going for the kill, mistimes it. Point will go to Lewis County. Score is 17-16. Here's the serve. Rigsby underneath it. Putman will set it up as they look to get it over. And they'll be out of play. Point will go to Lewis County. They lead by two. Atkins will check out, check it out, check it in for her. That is Lake and Franks. Here's the serve. Pettis underneath. Back over. Inman. As they will send it over to Summertown, and that one will go to Lewis County, finds the gap. Here's the serve. The uh, man to meet the legend, Will Pettis, is here. Up in the air. Kelsey now. Putman will set it up. Here's Cornelius in the middle, times it up, and down for the kill. Summertown trails by two. Here's the serve by Cornelius. Rowell underneath it. There's Riley. Emmett will look to send it over. Still up in the air. Putman underneath it. As Franks will send it over. Emmon underneath that one. Ross will set it up back to Emmon. She will look to get it over. Cornelius back to Lewis County. Kelsey underneath it. Pettis looks to go for the block, and that point will go to Summertown anyways. Here's a serve by Cornelius. As it's up in the air. And miscommunication, and we're tied up. So here's the serve. And it's up in the air. Rice. Riley will look to get over with the left hand short. And Summertown takes the lead. And we're going to have a timeout taken by Lewis County as they trail by one. As we'll be back here shortly on the Exports Network. Do you have a small farm, a big farm, or just critters in the backyard to feed? If you answered yes to any of those questions, then you need to make the short drive down to A&B Feeds in Etheridge, Tennessee today. Owner and operator Jamie Ayers has you covered and will treat you right. That's A&B Feeds in Etheridge, Tennessee. This is the X Sports Network. And back here on the Exports Network as Lewis County burns a timeout as they trail Summertown 2019 this first set. So the winner of this game will go on to face the Lady Warriors of Kolioka. And up in the air. And that point will go to Summertown. Cornelius back to serve once again. The two-point Lady Eagles lead. Here's the serve. Inman. That's Ross back to Inman. She looks to get it over. Ruben underneath it. Pettis will set it up. Here's Cornelius. She looks to get it over. And that's down. Point goes to the Lady Eagles. So 
Summertown three points away from taking this first set. And here's the serve. Up in the air, tries to save it towards the bench. And at that point, we'll go to Summertown again after the ace. Yes. Looks like Riley for Lewis County. There we go. Just had tire shoe real quick. And the action's back on their way. Emmon high up in the air. So they look to get it over. That is Rupert sent back. Pettis underneath it. Putman sets up Pettis in the middle, going for the kill, and that's down for the kill. And it's set point for Summertown. Here's the serve by Cornelius. Short of net goes back to the Lady Panthers as the score is 24 to 20 now. Back to serve is Rice. She will serve it over the net. Cornelius and now being ace. It's now 24 to 21. Franks, excuse me, that's actually Cornelius checking out, coming in for her, will be number 20. That is Ella Stanley. And here's the serve. It's up in the air, and point will go to Lewis County. Another ace, 24 to 22 is the score. Here's the serve. So they get it over. Rubin underneath it. Rigsby. And it's up in the air. Off of Lewis County and Summertown will win the first set 25 to 22. As they are one step closer to taking this win. As we'll be back here shortly for the start of the second set as Lady Eagles look to close it out. That's up next here on the Exports Network. From our humble beginnings to today, Parks Lumber Company has continuously served Lawrence and surrounding counties for over a century. Although we started as a small lumber yard in 1896, we have grown to include everything you need to make your dream project come to life. No matter your building needs, our experienced staff will be with you every step of the way to ensure you receive the highest customer service and attention to detail you deserve. Visit us at 106 Second Street or on Facebook. We guarantee you will see working with PLC is as easy as one, two, three. Don't just find a job, find a career with Resource MFG. The team at Resource MFG in Lawrenceburg has the resources and experience to find you a full or part-time position right away. Now recruiting for open positions in Lawrence, Giles, and Murray counties. Whether you're entering the workforce for the first time or looking to take your career to the next level, let your journey begin with Resource MFG. Located at 300 Ellingson Street in Lawrenceburg, phone 931-570-2111 to jumpstart your career today. For decades, First Class Charter has provided high quality motor coach transportation services to the Tennessee Valley. With numerous safety and cleanliness accreditations, First Class Charter is ready to make your group trip a reality. Contact us today by visiting firstclasscharter.net. First Class Charter, the official motor coach company of the North Alabama Lions. The Hidden Garden, located just off the square in downtown Lawrenceburg, is your hometown oasis for massage, aesthetics, full hair and nail services, and body waxing. Gift certificates are available, and be sure to follow them on Facebook for their specials. The Hidden Garden, your peace, your place. 222 Pulaski Street, Lawrenceburg, Tennessee, or phone 931-762-9799. A local law firm respected throughout the state. Generations of clients have turned to Boston, Holt, and Durham since 1948. We assist individuals and businesses with their legal needs, including real estate, property closings, personal injury, employment discrimination, and family law. Our clients get the personal attention and convenience of a hometown law firm 
with the resources and ability to handle any case. Come see us at Boston, Holt, and Durham. This is the X Sports Network. And back here at Summertown High School as we're here for the game between the Lewis County Lady Panthers taking on the Summertown Lady Eagles here in the TMSAA Area 13 tournament. That first point will go to Lewis County. And Summertown won the first set 25 to 22. And then back to serve. River underneath, Putman will set it up as Atkins will float it over. Pots underneath, Emmon will look to get it over. Stay up in the air, River. Here's Cornelius, Emmon. It's up in the air. Atkins looks to get it over, Rice. There's Kelsey now, just over the net, Cornelius able to save it though, Rigsby. Back to Cornelius, she goes for the kill, Emmon underneath. So they set it up. Kelsey looks to get it over. Tipped up by Cornelius. Tip in the air, though, for Summertown. Rupert. And that point will go to Lewis County. Here's the serve. Back over to Lewis County. Rice will set it up. Here's Potts with the right hand. And Putman tries to save it. Point will go to the Lady Panthers again. And it's a 3 0 lead. Emmon <laughs> served once again. And it's Putman underneath it. Over to Atkins. Just over the net. And that point will go to Summertown. Rigsby back to serve as it's a two point Lady Panthers lead. So here's the serve. That one is just short. Goes back to Lewis County. Here's the serve by Potts. Underneath it is River Putman will set it up. Here's Cornelius, looks to float over short of the net point. We'll go to Lewis County again. Here's the serve. They set it up, back over, and short of the net. Riley tried to get it over. That one goes back to Summertown. It is five to two. Served by Cornelius, short on that, back over to Lewis County. Stanley will come in the game for Cornelius now. Here's the serve. Stanley, As they try to make a play on Atkins. Rigsby will send it back over. And that's Potts underneath it. As they set it up. Emmon looking to get it over. And it's up in the air, trying to make a play on Stanley, and point will go to Lewis County once again. It's a five point Lady Panthers lead. So here's the serve as they look to get it over. Pumping underneath it. And it's, here's Pettis going for the kill, and that's down for the kill. Point will go to Summertown. Phoenix will check into the game. So here's the serve. It's up in the air, Rice. Rye will set it up. Over to Riley. Still up in the air. Pumman will set it up. Back to Pettis. Going for another kill. And that will be down. Back-to-back -back kills for Macy Pettis.
Here's the serve. And just short of that goes back to Lewis County as they take a four-point lead. Kelsey to serve. And she will get it over the net. It's back over to Lewis County. They set it up. Emman will push it over. Coming underneath. Back to Pettis in the middle. Goes for another kill. Still up in the air, though. Back to Summertown. And that point will go to the Lady Eagles. Here's the serve once again. Kelsey underneath it. As Emmon will get it over. Ruben underneath. They set it up. Rigsby gets it over for Summertown. Says set it up back to Emmon. That one will be down for the kill. Point will go to the Lady Panthers. Scores nine to five. As Riley will check out. Checking in for her will be Richardson. Going back to serve will be number 19. That is Hensley again. She will go back to serve. Short of that point will go to Summertown. Stanley will check out Cornelius. We'll come back into the game. Here's the serve by Pettis. It's up in the air. As they look to get it over, nobody's going to back row, and point will go to Lewis County. Here's the serve. Just over the net, able to save it though. As back over, they look to get it over, and that point will go to Summertown. Rupert will come back in, back to serve. Here's the serve once again. That one is served long. It will go back to Lewis County. And it's a four point Lady Panthers lead again. Here's the serve. It's up in the air as they set it up. As River able to get it over. Still up in the air. Kelsey now. Pettis with the save. Putman now. As they look to get it over, they will do so. And Emmons sends it back. Up in the air as they set it up. Over to Atkins. She goes for the kill. Richardson underneath it. As they look to get it over. Still up in the air. And that'll be out. Point will go to Summertown again. 11 to 8 is the score. So here's the serve by Rigsby once again. Emmon just over that, still up in the air. Rigsby able to save it. And they get it back over to Lewis County. Potts back up in the air. Rigsby once again. Richardson as they set it up. Up in the air. Putman sets it up. Here's Cornelius going for the kill. Off of Emmon. Point will go to Summertown. And that'll be a timeout by Lewis County as they lead by two, as we'll be back here shortly here on the Exports Network. Here at Heritage Automotive, experience the difference. With our great sales department, service department, and parts department. Now offering up to $10,000 off on all Chevy and GMC model 1500s. And we have over 30 lenders with some of the best rates in the market. Hi, it's Tad with Heritage Automotive. And we want you to know when it comes to your vehicle, you deserve help, not hassle. With our 30 plus years of experience of being your local dealership, we're here to serve you. So whether it's routine maintenance, mechanical repairs, collision repairs, we're here to help. So give us a call today to schedule your service. Heritage Automotive, expect more, experience the difference. This is the X Sports Network. 
And back here on the Exports Network, as Lewis County takes a timeout as they lead 11 to 9 over Summertown. They look to set it up. Kelsey looks to get it over, and I'll be down for the kill. Point will go to the Lady Panthers. Leads back out to three. Here's the serve as it's up in the air. Pumpkin will set it up. Atkins will just shove it over. Kelsey will send it right back. Pettis underneath it. He's looking to get over. Atkins once again floats it over, still up in the air. Rice, Pumpkin underneath it. Here's Cornelius, sends it back over. Kelsey, Emin underneath that one. They will send it back to Summertown. Cornelius will send it back, still up in the air. Kelsey, and that will be long point, will go to the Lady Eagles. Holt will go in to serve for Summertown. So here's the serve. It's up in the air. Rigsby. Putman looks to punch it over. And that point will go to Summertown. And it's a one point Lady Panthers lead. Here's the surf. It's up in the air. Emin now, as they look to get it over, that's blocked by Pettis, and we're tied at 12. Here's the serve once again. Emin underneath it. Rice will set up underneath it. Back to Emin, and I'll be down for the point, and Lewis County retakes the lead. Stanley will check back into the game. Here's the serve. And I'll be down for the ace. Serve once again as they get it over. That one goes long. Point goes back to Summertown. Scores 14 to 13. Atkins back to serve. And she will get it over the net as it's up in the air. They look to set it up back over to Summertown. Here's Pettis going for the kill. Inman showing the net and we're tied up once again. Here's the serve as they just get it over the net. Back over Pettis, shoulder net this time. Point will go to Lewis County. So here's the serve by Kelsey and gives it right back to Summertown and we're tied at 15 once again. Here's the serve. This is up in the air. Emin. They set it up. Back to Emin on the left side. Showing that goes to Summertown as they take a lead. Here's the serve once again. Kelsey underneath. Rowling underneath that one. Here's Emin looking to get it over the net, which she will. Putman underneath it. Here's Rigby with the setup as they look to get it over. As they look to get it over, tipped up, Pettis, there's Rigsby, high up in the air, and Rupert will get it over, Kelsey back over to Summertown, Phoenix now, there's Putman underneath, here's Pettis, she will just float it over the net, here's Emin, gets it over, Rigsby underneath it now, as they look to get it over, somehow get it over, 
And Emmett will send it right back. Still up in the air, though. Putman underneath it. Pettis will send it back over to Lewis County. Kelsey back over. Pettis underneath that one. Putman will set it up. Pettis in the middle. Looks to float it over. Riley tries to save it. Sent back. Back and forth they go. Putman underneath as they try to get it over. And they're able to do so. Emmett sends it back. As they set it up. Over to Phoenix with the left hand still up in the air. And they send it back. And that will be out. Point will go to Summertown. Lady Eagles take a two-point lead. So here's the serve. Rice underneath it. It's up in the air. Emman will send it back. As they set it up, here's Rigsby. She'll float it over. And that'll be out of play. Just hung on the net. Goes to Lewis County. Here's the serve by Riley. She will get it over the net. And as Rupert will get it over. Kelsey still up in the air. Inman. Putman now able to save it out of the net. Phoenix will look to get it over and able to do so. so they set it up back to Inman. She'll look to send it over and point will go to Lewis County. And we're tied once again. Here's the serve. Banks underneath that one. Back over to Lewis County. They look to send it over. Rigsby, Rupert now. It's back over the net. Kelsey looks to get it over. As they set it up. For Pettis here in the middle, she looks to float it over. Still up in the air. And that'll be short. And point will go to Summertown. Cornelius will come back in. Pettis will go back to serve. As for Lewis County, Riley will check out. Richardson will come in for her. Here's the serve by Pettis. High up in the air as they set it up. Phoenix looks to get it over, short of the net, and we're tied up once again. Here's the surf up in the air. At that point, we'll go to Lewis County, and they will take the lead as we're tied up as we'll be back here shortly here on the Exports Network. Since opening our doors in 1904, Biltwell Bank has existed to be the local economic engine for the communities we serve. No matter if you're buying a car, saving for retirement, or finally buying that forever home, Biltwell Bank is here to help. From personal checking and savings accounts, to a full suite of business and commercial banking with treasury management services, we'll make sure you'll have a dedicated Biltwell banker that understands your unique needs and stands by you every step of the way. No matter where you are in Tennessee or Northwest Georgia, there's likely a Biltwell bank location nearby. Come see us and let our dedicated financial team help you with all of your banking needs. Member FDIC. This is the X Sports Network. And back here on the X Sports Network. And Summertown takes a timeout as they trail Lewis County 19 to 18 in this second set. They're trying to check the score, make sure everything's where it needs to be. Yes. If I'm going off what Kevin says, and he's usually right, the score should be 19 to 18. As Kevin, you are right. Look at that. Yeah. As Summertown trails Lewis County by one. Then again, the winner of this game will take on Kolioka to see who will go to the championship game to take on South Lawrence. How 
And it looks like we got everything figured out. And I'm assuming the score is tied up at 18. They took the 19 off, so it is 18. Oh, that fixed it. Okay, never mind. Kevin was right. And the action's back underway. Pettis underneath it. Back over to Lewis County. Inman. Rice underneath that one. Inman will send it back over. Pettis underneath it. As they set it up for Cornelius in the middle. She floats it over to defense. Still up in the air, though. They send it back. Pettis now. They set it up once again for Cornelius. She looks to float it over. Port will go to Lewis County. And they take a two-point lead. Here's the serve as they get it over. And it's Phoenix. Pettis looks to get it over, able to do so. They set it up. Emman with the right hand. Rigsby high up in the air. As Cornelius sends it back. Kelsey underneath it. Rice now. Emman looks to get it over. Putman underneath it. There's Rigsby. Now Atkins. She will get it over. Kelsey. They set it up. Looking to get it in the middle. Pettis. They set it up. Phoenix and out of a reach point will go Lewis County again. Rowler with the serve as Rigsby. Phoenix with the save. It will be Kelsey up in the air. Richardson looks to get it over. Pettis and that point will go Lewis County again. With a sub here. Coming into the game will be Franks again. As it's a four point Lady Eagles lead. Here's the serve. As it's up in the air. Pettis underneath it. As Rigsby looks to get it over. Emmon underneath. They will send it up in the air. Back to Emmon. Pettis. Putman underneath it. As Rigsby looks to get it over. Kelsey now. Up in the air. Emmon will look to send it back. Pettis underneath it. Tipped up. Cornelius. And Summertown gets it back over to Lewis County. Here's Emmon now. Still up in the air. Putman underneath it. And Rigsby will send it back. Emmon. They send it up back to Emmon. She will get it over. Pettis underneath it. Still up in the air. And point will go to Lewis County. Here's the serve. Pettis underneath it. Back over to Lewis County. Rice will set it up. Back to Inman. And that one will just sail out of bounds. And it goes back to Summertown. As they trail by four. Rupert to serve. And here is the serve. And I'll be down for the ace. It's now 23 to 20. Here's the serve once again. Kelsey underneath it. They look to get it over. Still up in the air. Cornelius will punch it up in the air. Back over to Lewis County. Tipped up. As that point will go to Summertown. 23 to 21. Here's a serve once again. Kelsey. And we're going to have a timeout coming up by Lewis County as they lead Summertown 23-22. to 22. So We'll be back here on the Exports Network. There's a reason owners Tyler and Cindy McDowell chose the name In Service for their towing business. They did because it's their goal to be in service for you on the day that you need them the most. 
In-service towing is now known far and wide for their response time because minutes matter when you're broken down. Or their 24-7 availability, you can call them anytime for service. Their professional team with years of experience and their fairness, plus their know-how in dealing with the unexpected. But the thing that in-service is known best for is how they treat their customers, and that's like family. When you need them, call them, 931-843-909. And back here on the X Sports Network as Lewis County burns their final timeout. As they lead Summertown 23 to 22. Summertown has to win one of the next two sets to move on to the championship, while Lewis County has to win this one and the next one. So here's the serve. Up in the air. Rice underneath it. As Richardson looks to get it over. Pettis underneath it. They will set it up. Here's Atkins. Up in the air. As they send it over, Pettis underneath. Putman will set it up. Here's Cornelius. Punches it over the net. Rice. Potts looks to get it over. Up in the air. As they send it back, still up in the air. And that point will go to Lewis County. Set point for the Lady Panthers. And we will have a timeout by Summertown as they trail. We'll be back here shortly on the Sports Network. Make your lawn a legacy. At Legacy Lawn and Landscapes, we put more than 16 years of experience into your goals. We won't meet your expectations, we'll exceed them. We offer consultation, installation, maintenance, hardscapes, construction, and land clearing services. Owner John and Jamie Brewer with their team are dedicated to providing the highest quality landscape services to commercial and residential clients in Middle Tennessee. Service, teamwork, results. That's how you leave a legacy. And back here on the Exports Network is Summertown. They've used their final timeout now as it's set point for Lewis County. Here's the serve. Rigsby. Putman will set it up back to Rigsby. She will get it just over the net. That point will go to Lewis County, and they will win that set. As we will go to the third and final set. As that will be coming up next here on the Exports Network. Got primary care? Find your way to better health with primary care by One Stop Medical. With decades of combined experience, you'll find a one-on-one -on -one relationship just like the old days, but with the convenience and technology of today. When One Stop Medical does primary care, it's the best. Call today for an appointment and find your way to healthy living. Serving Lawrenceburg, Pulaski, and Hohenwald. Phone 931-244-8220. Primary Care by One Stop Medical at its best. There are now more ways to save at Quick Mart. Become a Quick Club member and easily earn rewards on qualifying purchases at Quick Mart convenience stores using the Quick Club app. Available on the Apple App Store and Google Play. To save on fuel for work, use the Fuel Rewards Pro app to earn five cents a gallon on work fill-ups and redeem the savings for yourself. To get started, visit fuelrewards.com slash pro or download the app in the Apple App Store and Google Play. Southern Craft Manufacturing is dedicated to creating the finest quality and greatest value products in the death care industry. Southern Craft has perfected blending old world craftsmanship with modern manufacturing technologies to create a full line of steel, wood, and corrugated caskets. Family owned and operated for over 30 years, Southern Craft is now looking to hire local and regional truck drivers, welders, and production workers, each with great starting pay and a benefits package. For more information, visit southerncraftmfg.com. The Raptor Series from Hustler Turf. A premium line of residential mowers designed with a wide stance for operator comfort. 
a one-piece 11-gauge steel frame, and welded steel deck for added durability, finished off with premium Kawasaki V-Twin power. We are Hustler Turf, and this is Hustler Country. And back here on the X Sports Network as we're here for the third and final set of this game between Lewis County and Summertown. Here's a serve by Inman. So it's up in the air. Cornelius looks to go for the kill. Up in the air still as they send it right back. Putman will set it up. Going for it is Rigsby as they set it back up. Kelsey here on the left side, and that's down for the point. Goes to Lewis County. Here's the serve once again. Pettis underneath it. As Atkins, Pettis will try to get it over. Won't be able to do it. But it will go to Lewis County. Here's the serve by the Lady Panthers as it's up in the air. Bump will set it up. Atkins looks to get it over. Here's Kelsey now, and back to Atkins, over to Lewis County, as they set it up. They look to get it over, that's Inman. Ruben underneath it, as they set it up. Over to Rigsby. And they set it back up, back to Summertown. Putman. They look to get it over. Pettis underneath it, as they will set it up. Looks to get it over, in which they will not be able to do it. Point goes to Summertown. Here's the serve. And it's just over the net as Rowell up in the air. Pettis now Putman. Atkins will send it back over. Inman. Rice will set it up. Here's Kelsey going for the kill. And that's down for the kill. Point will go to Lewis County. Franks will check in. Here's the serve. Just over the net, Putman. And lucky break. That one goes to Lewis County again as they lead by three now. So here's the serve. They just get it over, and they will set it up. That's over to Franks. Goes long. Point will go to Lewis County again. And it's a four-point Lady Panthers lead. Serve once again. Riggs be underneath it. It's Putman now, and miscommunication goes to Lewis County. And it's a 5 0 Lady Panthers run. Back to serve as Potts. She will be shorter than that. Point goes back to Summertown. Cornelius back to serve. And she will get it over the net. Emmon underneath it. There's Kelsey. Emmon looks to get over short of the net. Goes back to Summertown. Three point Lady Panthers lead now. Here's the surf. As they get it over. Riley. It's up in the air. Hunt will set it up. Here's Pettis going for the kill. Still up in the air, and that point will go to Summertown as Riley was in the net. Here's the surf. They look to get it over. Able to do so. Atkins. They set it up, 
in the air, Kelsey. Rigsby still up in the air, and that one will go to Lewis County. Score is seven to four. And it's Rice to serve. She will get it over the net. And that'll be an ace. Now a four-point lead. Cornelius will come back into the game. Here's the serve. Cornelius. Putman. Here's Pettis going for the kill. Still up in the air. And that'll be down point. We'll go to Summertown. Here's the serve once again. Rice underneath it. Emman now will get it over. Putman up in the air. And that'll be out of play. Port will go to Lewis County. 9-5. to five, And we're going to have a timeout taken by Summertown as we'll be back here shortly on the Exports Network. For high school athletes, every game counts. You push your limits and you chase your dreams. But when injury strikes, you need more than just recovery. At Southern Tennessee Orthopedics, we're here to get you back in the game faster and stronger. From cutting edge treatments to personalized and compassionate care, we're here for your every move. Our specialized team of experts encompass decades of experience in sports related injuries. Dr. Paul Thomas, Melanie Durham, and Julie Marcus offer the most comprehensive care from diagnosis to recovery. With advanced treatments and tailored rehabilitation plans, we'll help you heal stronger and faster. Trust Southern Tennessee Orthopedics to keep you at your best because your future is worth it. This is the X Sports Network. And back here on the X Sports Network, Summertown takes a timeout as they trail Lewis County 9 to 5. As they look to get it over, still up in the air. Emma now looks to get it over. Alpha Atkins will go to Lewis County again. Here's the serve. Into the net, goes back to Summertown. Served by Putman. This is up in the air. Back over to the Lady Eagles. Pettis will set it up. Here's Phoenix now. As they'll set it up for Emmons. She looks to get it over. Still up in the air. As they set it up. Pettis going for the kill. Kelsey underneath it. They look to get it over. And that'll be off of Robert Point. We'll go to Lewis County again. Now a five point Lady Panthers lead. Here's the serve. It's up in the air. And they look to get it over. Riley, and that will be Summertown's point. Pettis back to serve. Cornelius will come back into the game. Here's the serve. It's up in the air. As they look to get over, Inman. Pettis underneath it. Rigsby. There's Phoenix now. Kelsey underneath it. And Inman will just put it over the net. Pettis. Putman. Cornelius showing the net. That goes to Lewis County. And we're going to have a timeout taken 
by Summertown again as they trail by five. We'll be back here shortly on the Exports Network. Whether you're looking to spruce up the interior or exterior of your home or business, trust Lawrenceburg Glass to provide a -a one-of-a-kind product. From windows to mirrors, shower doors, custom framing, storefront installations, and everything in between, Lawrenceburg Glass takes pride in our quality craftsmanship and strong attention to detail. With us, your customer experience always exceeds expectations. We're reliable, on time, and we deliver stunning results. Lawrenceburg Glass. Our passion is reflected in our work. Back here on the Exports Network, Summertown used their final timeout as they trail by five to Lewis County here in this third and final set. The winner of this game will move on to Kolioka. And here's the serve back over to the Lady Panthers. Emmon now gets it over. Putman underneath it. Rigsby as they look to get over. That's Atkins. Richardson underneath. Rice will set it up. Back over to Emmon. She looks to go for the kill. Pettis underneath it, though. Back to Lewis County. Hop in the air. Rigsby, Cornelius looks to get it over. Still up in the air, and they'll get it back to Summertown. Rigsby, Cornelius looks to get it over, as they will send it right back over. Up in the air, Cornelius once again. As back and forth they go, Pettis coming underneath. Cornelius one more time, and that one will be down this time. Summertown with the point. Rupert to serve. Here's the serve, just over the net. They set it up, and that point will go to Summertown. As we're gonna have a timeout taken by Lewis County now, as we'll be back here shortly on the Exports Network. At Smith Tax and Business Service, we offer many services. Along with personal income tax prep, we also offer tax preparation for corporations and partnerships. If you're a small business and looking for some extra help, give us a shout and we'll get you fixed up. Call Mary Beth Smith, Marion Matthews, Brooklyn Bates, or Michelle Staggs to find out how we can help you. Located at 208 Pulaski Street, phone 931-244-6633. We at Sassy Southern Designs are wishing all the football teams the best this season. We have merchandise for every school in the district as well as some outside the district as well. So come by and check us out. We're at 1294 First Avenue right behind McDonald's in Lawrenceburg. Back here at Summertown as Lewis County takes a timeout. As they lead 12 to 9 over Summertown. Here's the serve. Richardson high up in the air. As they look to get it over, Ross will do so. Now be out of play. Goes to Summertown. Two-point Lady Panthers lead. Here's the serve. Just over the net. Rice over to Inman. She looks good over, not able to do so. It's a one-point Lady Panthers lead now. Here's the serve. Richardson, high up in the air. Emmon has to get it over, able to do so. There's Rupert. Putman will set it up. Atkins will get it over, still up in the air. As they look to get it over, it's underneath it. They set it up. Atkins once again. Emmon underneath. They set it up. Emmon looks to get it over. Putman underneath it. Rigsby now. Atkins. There's Richardson. Rice now. Here's Emmon once again, Pettis underneath it. Up in the air still. As they look to get over. Here's Emmon, back and forth they go. Pettis now, high up in the air. Cornelius will get it over. There's Rowell, they'll set it up. Back to Emmon, they look to get it, Rigsby underneath. Putman underneath that one. Here's Cornelius, gets it over. And short of that, and it's tied up. Tie ball game here in the third set with the serve. And that's up in the air still. And point will go to Summertown, and they take a one-point lead. And we're going to have a timeout taken by Lewis County as they trail now. 
We'll be back shortly on the Exports Network. Being raised in Tennessee, we believe in the importance of family and community. Creating a positive experience at our family-owned and operated business is one of the ways we share that belief. Being in an accident can be extremely stressful. When it came time for my repairs, Mashburn's made it easy. I am lucky to have a wonderful company in my community like Mashburn's Collision Center. It's reassuring to know that I'm in good hands because their work is second to none. We pride ourselves that the Mashburn name is one of the most trusted in Lawrence County since 1981. Mashburn's Collision Center. Let our family take care of yours. Back here on the Exports Network as Summertown claws their way back as they lead by one. Here's the serve as it's up in the air as they will set it up. Cornelius sends it back to Lewis County. Rice as they will look to send it back. Putman underneath it. Here's Rigsby now. Atkins will look to send it over. As Rice underneath it. Back to Summertown. They will set it up. Cornelius going and that point goes to Summertown and it's match point. Here's the serve. It's up in the air. Short of that, if they're trying to save it, Emmons sends it back. Here's Cornelius going for the kill, and that will go. Summertown will win. As the Lady Eagles will fight back down 11 to 6 at one point, and they will move on. As they will be right back in action, they will play the Lady Warriors of Kolioka. And the winner of that game will play South Lawrence in the championship. So that will be next coming up shortly on the Exports Network. Going the distance with local sports. This is the X Sports Network.